Hey there, YouTube. Welcome to Drake Array Gaming. Today, we're going to be talking about crisp audio filtering. It's a really, really awesome tool, especially if you don't want to get into expensive microphone purchases or other applications or diving into all kinds of microphone settings. If you're looking for a simple, awesome tool that just works and makes you sound professional right off the bat, you're looking for crisp software. As usual, no BS, no fluff. Here we go. Right. In Streamlabs and everything, they do have built-in settings for, and you can see if I right-click here or click here, you can go to filters and uh, you can change filters for your microphone, etc. Um, if you do to edit filters and I can add all kinds of filters here with, you know, mic gain and all that. But if you want to do all that, you don't want to deal with buying an expensive microphone or dealing with settings in Streamlabs. I run something called Crisp. And you can see right now it's cutting out all the background. I have a fan going, I have air conditioning going, sound, sound, sound great. And how you do that, I'm going to go ahead and click down on my task tree icon. I already have it installed. Uh, you want to go ahead and um, download Crisp. I'll put a link in the description below. Um, I'm going to go ahead and go to my Crisp preferences here and just kind of show you. Um, so this is the K logo there. That's what it looks like. Um, so general, you know, my settings are in English. You got noise cancellation settings. So the background noise cancellation is turned on. Um, it has your sources here and you can... Uh, turn on for unrecognized microphone devices, different things. It's got performance modes. I have an auto mode here, but they also have a best noise cancellation mode that you can use. It might use more system resources, but even on auto mode, it sounds amazing for me. The rest of the settings are kind of fluff. The notifications, it would help to probably turn these off for your gaming and or streaming experience. Some of them you may or may not want need, but really how it works is it just installs a simple little app down here like this. And all you do is choose and you can see it's working right now. It's cutting out noise, cancellation, and volume. And they also offer a free trial. Um, this is a paid kind of application. It's really not that much. And they do offer a free trial. We can use it for like up to an hour a day, which is awesome. So you can really test drive it. Um, so if you're getting any type of echo or anything like that or feedback too, you can also apply it to your speakers. I didn't really need to do that. I'm just using it for my microphone right now. And you can easily just select your device right here and, and which one you wanna use and then just turn it on and see, now you can probably hear all my background noise and all this stuff. And then when you turn it on, you don't, you don't hear any of the background noise. And it's, it really, it's, it's, it's crazy how well it works. Um, you get bang tools together and all kinds of stuff. This works as good, almost as good, if not better than uh, NVIDIA Broadcast with the microphone filter on it. Um, so if you're looking for something that's free, definitely check out NVIDIA Broadcast and get those settings set up. Um, if you're looking for a paid service that works even better, I really recommend Crisp. It is a great application, easy to use, download, install, set your settings here. Um, you can go to the three little icons up here and check your preferences for notifications and things like we went through. But I use this. I love it. Um, and again, this and NVIDIA Broadcaster is just some of the best noise filtering uh, services out there. I hope this quick video on how to use crisp and some audio filters help you sound smooth on the microphone. I'm Drake Arade here to help the gaming streaming community, and I'll see you next time.